if you would have asked me a few years ago why I started working out, I probably would have said something like good looks and health and to live longer. But the truth is, I started working out because of my bullies. Because I wanted to stand up to my bullies. I used to be this really small kid. I was really short and really skinny and I couldn't really say the letter R and so I, I was bullied because of those things and you know kids, they bully you because of almost anything but I couldn't really stand up to myself because I was so weak and so small, basically. I remember clearly like one of my bullies was actually my old friend, like he used to be my friend and then he started hanging out with other people and who were bullying me and then he started bullying me too so that's nice you know like yeah that happens but he actually became the worst bully like of all of them and at that mo moment like i realized like nobody's gonna stand up for me if i don't stand up for me so I didn't start working out back then, but I really wish like I could be stronger and bigger and that's probably where all it started like in my head. But I didn't start working out until I was like on the ninth grade. So one day I was watching this show, Silver Fang, and I thought in my head, if you know Silver Fang, this is a story about a dog who's like really and this small dog who becomes, becomes like st one of the strongest dogs in the pack and stuff like that. You really have to watch that anime, it's really good, but... I was watching this show about Silver Fang and I, I thought in my head, I wanna be like Silver Fang. Because Silver Fang was really strong and he always like defended the weaker and he always was so brave because he fought like stronger opponents and stuff like that. So 12 year old me was like, damn, I wanna be like Silver Fang someday. And I started working out, I was, I think I was about 15 years old. I remember clearly my pull-ups went from 0 to 15 in a year. And I'm like still really proud of that. I started working out at 9th grade in my room's floor. I started doing push-ups and sit-ups and squats, like everything I would do with my body. And push-ups were great, like I loved push-ups and I did so many of them in a day. And once I was like, why don't I go to the gym? Like first gym I was working out was in my school gym. You know how school gyms get? They are like really small and no new equipment and that was how I started working out and I started going to the gym after school like once a week at start then I started going twice a week then I went for runs there was this eight kilometer run nearby I used to run that sometimes after after school and after junior high school I went to high school and I started going to the real gym, like this was the biggest gym in where I lived and it was really nice, I used to go five times a week. I started bulking because I thought that was the best way to gain muscles and size and now I don't think that at all, like bulking is not that good for you, I don't think, but you learn. and. I actually gained a lot of fat because of my bulking, it was like really dirty bulk. I probably gained about 8 to 10 kilograms, that's like I really dirty bulked and that's a lot of weight I gained because it was mainly fat and a little bit of muscle maybe. And obviously some water and stuff like that. And I really learned like that's not the way to go for me at least. And I don't believe in bulking. Like I learned a lot of that bulking and right now I'm where I am because I I did that so after that I I took it like a year I took it way easier when I got into high school I thought like 
school is more important to me and I didn't work out as much in my second year and that was a mistake but you learn and in the third year I think I worked out even more again and I got really into calisthenics if you don't know what calisthenics are they are basically body weight exercises for example push-ups pull-ups muscle ups handstands and stuff like that and like I said I got really into it and I'm still really into it I like that's my favorite type of exercise and Every summer I train outside and I love the sun and I, I love being outside because it's so nice weather in the summer in Finland and basically you just need a pull up bar so it's so easy to like work out with calisthenics and I started training different kind of tricks for example like front lever, back lever, handstand, planche and stuff like that and Calisthenics is for sure my favorite type of exercise. I have this one memory from junior high school. This was like the end of ninth grade when I had started working out. And this one bully came up to me and started pushing me. And I started pushing back. And at that moment I started pushing harder than him. And I realized like I was stronger than him. He wasn't like a lot bigger than me but a little bit. And that was like a really defining moment for me because I realized my hard work will pay off and it did pay off. Like I was stronger than my bully and I could easily stand up to him. And that is like a really important memory for me from junior high school. Because it felt so amazing to stand up to my bully. Female validation became a thing like I realized girls like females like muscles and I don't know this, this wasn't like that thing why I started working out and I remember uh, later in high school actually this one girl saying to me like I remember when you started like working out and started looking more muscular and I was like what do you mean and she was like yeah I noticed like you started working out and those were obviously new games for me because I just had started working out but it feel, felt like really good to hear that like later, like in high school, that I started looking more muscular when I started working out and that was actually really good memory to do and kind of defining moment. And like working out became an identity for me because I couldn't go to eat with my friends because I was so disciplined and I missed hanging out because I was I wanted to go. I had to go work out and I just keep like if my friends would go to eat, I couldn't do that because I couldn't eat like pizza and hamburgers and stuff like that. Now I have realized that it's important to make memories and like just go and have fun with your friends and family and girlfriends and stuff like that. Like don't, obviously if you're on prep that's completely different and it's important you work for that but if you're not on prep just enjoy life and enjoy good foods and good company like life is short and you have to enjoy everything you can there's no reason to punish yourself by not like eating and yeah obviously don't skip workouts <laughs> like that's important too but you know what I mean what I'm going for When I started working out, one of my dreams and goals became to be the guy who can do the most pull-ups in the room. Like, right now I am there, I can do the most pull-ups in my gym, for example. But you just have to have the me mental mentality to work for it and drive and keep going, even though it's, it's actually really hard to keep pushing, like... And fitness and health is of, of course important, but you have to keep in mind for your mental health what's good for you, like how hard can you go. Like I'm not saying you should start right now working out because if you haven't it's gonna be hard to start. But you just really think about it because health and fitness are quite important and it really like affects your life. 